What's popping YouTube? It's your boy Mike Powers. First things first, subscribers, shout out Simon Rosas. Simon Rosas, thank you for subscribing. Welcome to the channel. Let's get right into it. The purpose of this video is to clear up a mess that apparently I started when I brought up Jada Kiss's name in one of my videos. So if you were with me back then, you might remember I did a review of Rock Marciano's album, Marcelago. So I reviewed this album and I was feeling this album so much that by me trying to tell you how good this guy was, I end up taking a guy like Jada Kiss and saying that I thought Rock Marciano was better than Jada Kiss. That's what I said. So why did I do that? First of all, I did that because I was trying to think of a great New York MC that this guy was better than to explain to you the level of his proficiency on the mic. So what I did was I grabbed Jada Kiss's name. So I said, oh, I, I like this guy better than Jada Kiss, something to that effect. Well, then the comment section kind of went back and forth for a few weeks about who was the better rapper, Jada Kiss or Rock Marciano. With a lot of people chiming in saying that they thought Rock Marciano was the better rapper, the better MC, the better lyricist. But then there became a problem. And the problem is at the beginning and the problem is at the end. And this is where I'm going to fix the problem. The problem ended up being when I decided to chime in, I thought about this as I was watching people go back and forth in the comment section. And I decided, Hey, I'm about to weigh in on this and I'm going to give you what I believe my winner is. And that winner turned out to be rock Marciano. So why would I go and insert myself into that particular argument? put my face on camera, my voice on the mic to say, Jada Kiss is not better than Rock Marciano. Because at a certain point, it felt like I was piling on dude and disrespecting a legend. And I'll tell you why. Rock Marciano is phenomenal. And throughout these weeks, we reviewed the Rock Marciano album. We went back and forth about who was the better MC. And in that whole conversation, what got lost is that, in fact, Jada Kiss is a legendary MC who's dropped many classics. Now, I know I said on a couple of videos that I was a fan of Jada Kiss, but then I didn't say enough. Once I start engaging with people that are saying, oh, rock way better than Jada is no question. And I'm agreeing with it and I'm doing that publicly. What am I really doing? I'm pitting one great MC against another, one great New York MC against another great New York MC. Go shut that down real quick. And so for me, that became disrespectful to the legend. There's no reason to bring that man's name up in a way where I could be seen or it could be interpreted that I'm anyway denigrating this legendary MC. And this happened after I listened to a couple of JD kids verses just on mistake on YouTube. And I'm sitting there vibing to it. I'm feeling myself. I'm zoned out here. And I'm just stuck on the man's lyrics. And I said, whoa, did I really just come on camera and say Rock Marciano was just better than Jada Kiss? Did I do that? Why? What's the point? Except for to drag that man's name in the mud. You don't talk about a legend like that. So I'm a real hip hop head. I love the music and I love the artists. And at some point I got to talk shit about people. That's just part of the game. If you put yourself out there, somebody gonna say something about you. But at the same time, I better have a damn good reason before I drag somebody name in the mud. Jada Kiss ain't never switched it up. He never went like crazy pop and did nothing real goofy. As far as I can remember, if you might know something, let me know, but that probably would still be irrelevant. He only delivered some of the most fantastic bars we ever heard in hip hop. His contributions to the nineties is immeasurable and can never be forgotten. And I'm gonna look at my phone real quick. The songs that I do have from Jada, cause I open my mouth enough to say something real stupid when I'm talking about this Jada kids versus rock Marciano thing. When I'm doing the whole breakdown and you go back and watch the video that should have never been shot where I declare a winner. I said, Oh, what, 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 what he got? He got why? What else? And I know better than that. How, how stupid is that? As an authority on hip hop, how stupid was that? On my phone, right? 
I got Y, Checkmate, Problem Child. Remember them 50 Cent disses? The lyrics, like, Pearson. What else I got? Hold up. Rain featuring Nas. Uh, we Gonna Make It. With the Joel Ortiz remix of hip hop. His verse on that. He come on your song and steal it. Every time, that's what he was known for. And I'm sitting up here putting this man's name lightweight in the mud, even though I'm showing him respect. I'm trying to say, oh, this dude is so much better than him. That's lightweight denigrating that dude to be speaking his name like that. Not the legends. Top five dead or alive, he used to call himself all the time. Probably still call himself that shit. And he probably is. When you talk about lyricists. Now think about it. Now listen to this real quick. On the road to success, but it's more of a mission. They Woo! said I would be dead or I was going to prison. Yeah! One of them is certain, but the other one isn't. I yeah! made rare decisions. Rock diamonds that impaired your vision. Even supplied y'all years for lism. Like I'm just starting, but I got years of wisdom. Woo! Strikes I got nigga took years to get them. Whenever you see him, notice the same peers is with him. He destroys tracks the minute he hears the rhythm. Yeah! Only a hell of a flow, but his ears forbidden. Yeah! If you think this is a ringtone, yeah, you kidding? 50,000 <laughs> records sold right, yeah, you kidding? It was his time to go. He ain't care who did him. Didn't appreciate life and got aired for living. PCP by the leader. Good Chiba. Sergio Tech sweatsuit. Good Adidas. Yeah. Why would I ever talk bad about that guy? The guy that brought you what you just heard. And also, Maya, best of me. He was on that joint. Toe that joint. Fat Joe, Ja Rule, Jada Kiss last verse. Wise is awoken, and you know they say that you deserved it whenever you die with your eyes open. Like, he tore that shit up. So we don't do that. And I had to check myself that that I had a, a video in my collection. I started to delete it, but I don't really believe in deleting too much stuff. Like, I deleted a couple of live episodes I'm practicing or whatever, got rid of them. Cause it wasn't really nothing there, long ass videos, but this one, I did not decide to delete and I'm not going to delete it because I made that mistake on camera. That's my fuck up. And we all going to mess up and make mistakes, but I want people to come on my channel and see that mistake and see the evolution. Just that real hip hop. We don't do that shit over here. That shit that I did on that video, I should have never did it. And so even though Jadakiss probably will never see this video, I got to apologize to Jadakiss because when you put your name, when you put a man's name out there like that, you do it on camera. It's like, if you say something to a man, you got to be able to say it to his face. If you take credit from a dude, you got to be able to give credit. If you make something wrong, you got to be in a position to make that shit right. And I'm going to do that all on camera. I talk shit on camera. I was wrong on camera. I was stupid on camera. Now I'm fixing it on camera. Now if the debate of who is the better MC has been going on since the beginning of hip hop. There's nothing wrong with that conversation. There's nothing wrong with y'all having that conversation in the comment section. There's nothing wrong with us having that conversation at the barbershop. What's wrong is that I got a platform and I'm taking a position and I'm positioning myself as a fucking authority. And I hope that a few people around the globe would take my influence and respect it and go, oh yeah, that dude know what he talk about. So I gotta watch how I do the legends. He gave me no reason to go there. I was wrong. I should have never dipped my toe in that water at all. So I hope I fixed it. Uh, other than that, I'm Mike Powers. I'm out.